Finally got to take a break to uh, clean my AR-15s and my pistols, so I figured I would bring you a quick video before the lights go out. All right, jumping right into it, I'm just going to clear it for you guys. Nothing in the mag, nothing in the pipe, as I can see. Right, I'm not going to jump too far in depth into Beretta as a manufacturer. They are an awesome uh, business that makes awesome firearms. Uh, this video is more directed towards the Breda 96D Centurion's ability to chamber swap to a smaller caliber. The native caliber for the Breda 96D is a 40 Smith & Weston, and this gives it the diameter ability to go smaller to a 9mm. Here's the barrel that I bought um, off of an eBay page that was a pawn shop. I got it for like $65 because I just bid on it and got it, but I see a lot of these at gun shows because I'm here in Florida and they're pretty much everywhere. Um, the 92FS uh, magazine, which you could get at uh, Bass Pro, Cabela's, or even gun shows. But the awesome thing I think about this barrel swap, because a lot of platforms can do this, such as Glock or whatever pistols, um, is it's very smooth and quick. If you've ever field stripped a Beretta, then you know it's pretty easy. You need no types of gunsmithing knowledge to do it. And if you're in a zombie apocalypse type situation where you need two calibers and you need to switch barrels very fast, then this is perfect. So I'm just going to go ahead and go through um, field stripping it and changing out the barrel. I'll walk through pretty fast, but I'm going to assume that you guys know how to field strip a Beretta. All right, so go ahead and take the slide off, recoil spring, push the button for the locking block to come off. And then just make sure your locking block is in the right position to put this into the slide. Drop it in and make sure it fastens straight so that you can put your recoil spring on top of that. And then voila, you can just put that on top. Boom. Just switch out your magazines. And in theory, you should be able to just fire these 9mm bullets through there. Now that was faster than 30 seconds and I was taking a second to explain it. So imagine if you were in a situation where you had to fire these bullets for your life. Now thank you guys for watching this video. It was uh, very fun to make because I love this pistol. But um, if you want any videos in the future on firearms that I have. If you see my background, I got an AR-15, one right here against the wall. I have a few firearms that I think you guys would really like in depth. Um, please follow, subscribe my channel, and like this video. See you guys later.